Hello everybody and welcome to Lucky by Nature. I am B. Steven and thank you for hanging out with me today. Please show your amazing support by smashing the like button and if you are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe so you can get your daily dose of ARC. In the past I have shown you guys how to clear the Caverns of Lost Hope with the Golem as you see here. And then we also showed you guys how to do it with our Carquinos. And of course, these guys are both very unique because one, they don't have the oxygen icon. So you don't have to worry about that. And also nothing really notices you. And uh, well, unless you hit them and even then uh, they only notice you for a little bit. They attack you for a little bit and then they pretty much leave you alone. But um, if you don't really want to clear the cave and you just want to go get the artifact there's actually a third choice and that is none other than the drake now the drake does have an oxygen uh, icon so obviously we have to make sure that you have enough oxygen but the most important thing i would say is the stam the stamina on these guys i have this one at around 2000 so I wouldn't have them any less than 2,000, but I will show you that later. But for now, we're just going to go ahead and cruise on down to the cave. And so you shouldn't have much uh, issue at the very beginning. It's once we get in that uh, it could be very, very dangerous. And I did test this just, you know, just swimming around and things like that. And I found that things do aggro on you but as long as you're invisible like this as long as you have the camo on then you should be good to go but as you know if you use the camo you are going to be using a hell of a lot more stam which is why my suggestion is 2000 stam at the very least and even then you have to be careful because uh, you have to keep an eye on the stem more than anything but also the oxygen because that will, could be devastating so you have to know your way around this cave uh, I almost went too far out uh, there's this little area here right before where the artifact is and you can actually go up oh, let me try that again but there's always things here that you have to deal with. So let's go ahead and kill all these Onyx. Because uh, as soon as uh, we reveal ourselves, then we would be, uh, start getting attacked. And we don't want to deal with that. So let me try to get these guys to fall off. I'm talking about the, the Scorpions. And then we got to kill these Onyx. And I'm going to start running out of stam here pretty soon so this um, Drake is not really all that strong so that's why I'm not doing all that great uh, against these guys so the melee is pretty low and plus I mostly concentrated on the other two things that I that I mentioned before the oxygen and the stam but, um, you know, we should be fine still. We didn't sustain too much damage, so let's go ahead and uh, get on here so we can get our stam back. Because, as you can see, the stam is almost completely gone. So, soon, as soon as we get our stam back, then we are going to go ahead and jump back in there. Hopefully, we won't get attacked by anything else. There we go. All right, and like I said, you have to know your way around. Um, the artifact should be just right here to our right slightly. And we should be able to go right into that little hole. Unlike the golem, obviously, if you were to get, get in there, uh, yeah, you're not bringing that guy back out. But with a Carquinos and this guy, you should have no problem. The only thing that I can, uh, that I sh uh, need to caution you about is uh, try not to touch 
any of these uh, water dinos because if you do more than likely they are going to attack and especially those sharks because the sharks are usually the ones that uh, do tend to attack just about anything and so we're gonna do this pretty quick we are going to just get off get on as fast as possible before anything starts coming after us alright that wasn't too bad but also notice our stam our stam is running a little low so we gotta get back to our little area oh crap I th oh yep I accidentally touched that guy that's okay as you can see this guy can swim pre uh, pretty decently but uh, yeah that's a worry uh, if all the sharks aggro but they should only do it for a very very short time all right uh, whoa that thing's pretty bloody I wonder what the heck it fought I know it wasn't me <laughs> okay so we need to make our, uh, our way back to that little platform we were on earlier and that is very important because there is no way that you could uh, come in and go out just uh, on one go. There's just no way. I took off the camo just because uh, I don't want to completely run out of uh, stam. Otherwise, we'd be in a lot of trouble. As you can see, it's already a bit low. Alright, so now we're just waiting to get our stand back and now we just gotta make our way out and so basically all you do is uh, slightly to the left over here oh no what are you doing that's even better and it's just a uh, pretty much a straight shot out a straight shot and the beauty about this is you can also get the other artifact on uh, the west uh, underwater cave and it should pretty much be the same thing you can go in and actually that one should be a lot easier just because of the fact that you don't really have all that much stuff there and you have places where you can actually rest in between so I don't really think I need to show you guys that part of it right because uh, typically this is the the harder cave and so as you saw it was uh, pretty easy I will go ahead and show you the stats here as soon as we get back to the top and we're gonna stall out here for a little bit and also the other thing that I forgot to mention if you notice I don't have the little hands here uh, the you know the little imprinting little buff and that is because I did not use this character to raise this Drake. That that character is still in uh, the aberration server. So this is uh, the island um, little character that I'm using. And obviously, I'm not gonna have the buff unless I use that the same character that I used to imprint on it. And that was easy enough so like I said if you're just going strictly for the artifacts all you need to do is what I just showed you and this is the fastest way I mean you can also try <laughs> your hand with uh, uh, a dolphin or HT or whatever it's called um, and obviously you can run in there really fast uh, but uh, eh. You, they're gonna notice you and they're gonna plug the hole so just be aware of that uh, on your way in so as you can see it is imprinted on me uh, but also notice the stem and notice the oxygen I did have to put a little bit of oxygen in there um, but th that oxygen does pretty pretty good but that is pretty much it guys uh, it's pretty nice and simple but uh, you know this is uh, more or less just uh, 
letting you guys know about this. Uh, I don't know if you guys knew, but uh, if you didn't, there you go. So there's a third option. But uh, that's it for me. So until next time, keep surviving. My work saved the human race. Thank you.